Hello, South Pacific family. I'd like to give you uh, information about how to do leadership development. We have a number of great opportunities. But first, let me give you an update about what happened this past summer at Life Conference. We had uh, 4,300 students, 1,300 workers for a wonderful gathering in Florida. And there were over 700 students that responded to the call of God to serve him. We've done, we, the national office has done uh, the, the research behind it and discovered that that event and that service has the greatest impact on sending people in a direction for full-time service of serving the Lord. That's exciting news. Speaking of future, we need to be building a future leaders as we grow. And if we don't develop leaders, we're just going to be stagnant as a church. And so the, again, the website the National Office has created to help you uh, to develop leaders is really, really helpful. It is the Alliance Center of Leadership Development. We call it ACLD for short, but it's allianceleaders.org. And there are several different tracks. You can help grow your elders. You can help grow a governing board. There's a track to help teach and train uh, a church treasurer. But there's one called School of Ministry. And the School of Ministry is a two-year track that will give all the requirements necessary for someone to become ordained as a pastor within the Christian Missionary Alliance or consecrated. And so it has the 30 hours of Bible. It has the polity. It helps teach. Uh, how to preach uh, and teach the word. We currently have 28 people enrolled in the School of Ministry within our district that I know of. <clears throat> and I want to encourage you, as you think about the future of your church, to raise up leaders and to challenge people and offer that opportunity. The cost for a two-year program is $3,600, but $3,600 will get them in a position to go through the process of being showing yourself approved and becoming ordained or consecrated. Of those 28 students, 17 are Spanish speaking. Now I'm really excited about this because we have such a wonderful, in, in the Southern quarter, uh, Southwest quarter of the America, we have a large percentage of opportunity to the Spanish community, but we don't have the people, we don't have the leaders. But this is a new tool that will develop leaders. So your district fair share giving has helped us. We have 17 Spanish speaking students currently enrolled and are going through the training to become uh, pastors and church leaders within the church. And so I see our future very exciting. And that's because thankful to you for your district fair share, we're able to invest. Uh, and raise up leaders for uh, church planting and church growth in an area where we only have 10 Spanish-speaking churches in our district. And we should have so many more. So, look around. If your church doesn't speak Spanish, maybe you need to think about adding a Spanish speaker, a Spanish service. If you are in a neighborhood that has a different culture, think about adding that. We need to present the gospel in a number of ways. So if you are interested in learning more about ACLD, the School of Ministry, or how to train your board or elders, uh, or you want information about the Life Conference, please contact us here. I have a great staff who would love to help you. I appreciate your time. May the Lord richly bless you as we serve the Word together.